paid 2,000 life points. Oy, that is pretty pricey for a card. Declare one monster name. Then your opponent gets to search through their deck for that one monster. And if they have the monster that you declared, guess what? They get to apply one of the following effects. Number one, they get to search for that card and add it to their hand. Number two, I really hate this one. They get to special summon that monster, ignoring the summoning conditions. Basically, this spell card turns the face of mirror matches drastically. Not completely, just like a small margin of it. I mean, there are a lot of cards out there that can do just that. But this card in particular will make mirror matches a little bit intriguing. This basically says for Cosmos, yeah, yeah, brother, can I, can I, can you help me out with a tin can? I really need a tin can so badly. Yeah, this card is pretty legit, but at the same time, depending on what you face, especially the meta decks that are out now, Cosmos, Monarch, anything of that nature, you're already going to see a lot of these decks using this spell card. Do I believe it'll get hit in the future? Possibly. Until then, we gotta see how that goes. Something tells me they may keep this card for like a whole year and then probably hit it in the next format or so. Then again, it's Konami. They can change the rules anytime. I personally believe that this could change the course of Yu-Gi-Oh overall as far as its effect goes. But as far as a main deck card goes, it's possible. Side card, definitely a maybe. But it's completely up in the air as far as the effect goes, but I love it overall. It's legit though, don't get me wrong. So anyway, that's my review on Lullaby of Obedience. And yeah guys, I think this card is pretty good. We'll, we'll see how it goes. Anyway, hope you all enjoyed this little card review that I put together. Please leave a like and favorite if you did. If you enjoyed it, leave a suggestion on what the next review should be and I'll get back to it as soon as I can. Hit me up in the comments, don't forget to subscribe, and until next time, this is Smash Adams, and I'm signing out.